Hi, I'm Troy Donahue, owner of Tilter Trailers, and I'd like to demonstrate how our trailers operate. To load your vehicle, remove the linchpin to release the trailer. Open the air valve to release the air from the airbags and leave this valve open while loading. Once the back of the trailer touches the ground, you are ready to drive on. Your front tires must rest hard against the stops at the front of the tracks. Leave your car in gear or park and apply the handbrake. You can now carefully get out of the car using the trailer's mud guard as a step. Close the air valve and turn on the compressor to reinflate the airbags. Replace the linchpin once the trailer has reached its correct height. The tie-down straps come in two components per tyre. The first strap is looped around the tyre and hooked into the mesh of the tracks behind the wheel. The loop can be adjusted to the size of your tyre by using the cam buckle. The second strap loops around the drawbar and is threaded between the first strap and the tyre. The ratchet is then used to pull the strap as tight as possible. Repeat this procedure with the other front tyre. To unload your vehicle, pull out the linchpin to release the trailer. Remove the tie-down straps from the tyres. Open the air valve to release the air from the airbags and keep this valve open while unloading. Once the back of the trailer touches the ground, you can safely reverse your car off. Our slotted floor design trailer weighs 680 kilos and can carry most vehicles up to 2,000 kilos. The checker plate floor design weighs 715 kilos and can also carry most vehicles up to 2,000 kilos. A range of accessories can be fitted to our tandem axle trailers. These include jerry can holders, tire racks, stone guards and winches. Due to the trailer's unique no axle design, a large toolbox can also be fitted. To load the single axle trailer, release the locking mechanism so the trailer can tilt. Line up the front wheels with the tracks and slowly and smoothly drive onto the tracks. The trailer will automatically come down and lock when you go past the center point of balance. Make sure the front tires come to rest hard up against the stops. Leave the car in gear or park and apply the handbrake. You can now carefully get out of the car using the trailer's mud guard as a step. The tie-down straps come in two components per tire. The first strap is looped around the tire and hooked into the mesh of the tracks behind the wheel. The second strap loops around the drawbar and is threaded between the first strap and the tire. The ratchet is then used to pull the strap as tight as possible. Repeat this procedure with the other front tire. To unload your vehicle, remove the tie-down straps from the front tires. Release the lock so the handle sits on the corner of the trailer. This unlocks the tracks and will allow the trailer to tilt when reversing your vehicle. Slowly and smoothly, reverse your car off the trailer. This is how to apply the handbrake to the single axle trailer. This lever allows you to reverse your trailer up hills without the override brakes applying. For normal driving, this lever should be left open. If you'd like any more information on our products, either ring us or send us an email. Thanks.